Assalamu alaikum everyone. Today's video is on my grow room. Grow room, or some people call it a grow tent. Now this is in my aviary, in my bird room, out in the shed. So it gets very cold outside, it gets below minus. In here is where it gets very cold, but in this room, grow room, as you can see, at the moment it's showing, I don't know if you can see, 15. It goes down to about 12 at night, 10 to 12, and then it goes up to 21. At the moment it's showing this because I've opened up the cover. I've opened up the cover. I'll show you what I do with it when I close the cover. And in here at the moment, as you can see, I've got my Santi light. That's a 35 watt light, I believe it is. Grow light, which is connected. This is on for 12 hours, 10 to 12 hours. And then in the back, as you can see, I've got some tarot. Now all these plants, I'm just experimenting with these. And then I've got some bottle gourd seeds that are growing. I've got some baby chili plants that are growing. I've got some cilantro that's growing. This is from Bangladesh. I received this just yesterday. It arrived yesterday. So I put it in a pot and let's see if it works, if it survives. I've got a chili plant in here as well. So all this is for an experiment just to see how well this room does. So please do not grow your bottle gourd seeds yet. It's still too early. We've still got about another month more than a month in March our first or second week of March is probably best to grow them I've got my Musa Cavendish here baby ones which I've put in here I've separated these pups yesterday and I've just stuck them in here I don't know if they'll survive so all this as you can see I've got full paper all around just to keep the heat in there and then in the back I've got a heater there you go I've got a heater which is on about 80 90 watts and that's on for about 15 hours that is 15 or 16 hours it's on a timer these are all on a timer and then here as you can see the cable i've got undersoil heating cable undersoil heating cable so that's on 24 hours the soil heating cable is on 24 hours it does not go off the heater goes off for a few hours i think about about 15 hours the heater and the light this one is on about 15 hours. So eight hours they turn off. And then temperature as you can see at the moment is it's going down. It's going to 14 because I've opened up the front cover for it. This little sand around it, as you can see. So Marshall, I'm just testing it. If it does work, I'll be using this. If it doesn't, I'm not sure. <laughs> Well, it should work. I mean, at the moment, the temperature outside goes below minus two sometimes, minus one. And in here, the, I think the lowest it goes to is about 10 or 12 when the heat is off, from what I've seen. So what I do, once this is all done, I close up the cover, let me show you. So, I've got a little cover in here. See this cover? I close this up. I've got Velcro on the side. Good old Velcro. And then... Yeah, yeah. Make sure it's nice and tight. Make sure the thing doesn't go up. Stretch that. There you go. So that's all closed up. The heat will go up now. It will go up to 21, 22, maybe even more. Depends on the outside temperature as well. Now, if we go around the back, let me show you how wired this. Well, I've got the timer, which is which controls all the lights and the electric power and everything in the back. If we come around the back. Just around the back here, you see the timer. Now, the timer, it comes on for about 15, 16 hours. So at the moment, what I've got, it comes on at 10 in the morning and it works all the way until two o'clock. So it'll come on at 10 and it'll turn off at 2 a.m. in the morning. So 10 morning till 2 a.m. at night. So in, yeah, one well, more. 2 a.m. 2 a.m. at night so that's all wired up so the underfloor under the soil heater under soil heater that stays on all the time and the rest of it just comes on and goes off on the timer so that is it guys that is my heat room so that is it guys that is my grow room there you have it inshallah i'll do updates on it see how the plants do and if it does work well i'll put more plants in it all my seedlings i might have to actually the more plants i put in here i might have to add a fa fan in here i will add a fan just to circulate all the air and oxygen carbon monoxide and everything everything in there 
So once again, thank you all for watching. Please don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe. And assalamu alaikum.